Warning, this might cause some seizures, so, uh, you know, look away if you need to. But if you don't want to, just soak it in. Hmm. Here we go! So for today's mail time, I've got two packages from Amazon and a mystery bag from our friends at Banga. So I'm really curious what's in here. Let's go ahead and get this opened up. Ooh, stickers. Looks like they sent me some food for the Sky Party in the form of 3S batteries. Mmm, the Sky Party's gonna be happy. Alright, let's get one of these open. I've been running 2S on my Sky Party and it can do 3S, so I'm excited to see what kind of performance boost I get on that. So this is an 11.1 3S, 500 milliamp hour, 45C lithium polymer battery. Now this has more voltage than my 2S batteries um, and it comes with an XT60, so I'm gonna have to cut off the XT60 and solder on my own XT30, but that's no problem, I can do that. And uh, I'm excited to see how much oomph the little Sky Party gets with these 3S batteries. All right, and now the next thing that I got from Amazon. These are a little bit different than what I'm usually doing. Uh, this, and some of you might have already guessed by now, is a LED strip. And what I was wanting to do with this is I want to create some gates to fly through indoors, but I wanted them to be lit up because that just looks really cool. So uh, I was looking at doing some different things with different power supplies and supplying 12 volts and yada, yada, yada. And then I found these and they run off of USB. So if you have one of these external batteries to, to recharge your phone, these work great. Let's see, we'll just plug this in and blammo, it starts working. Now it's pretty cool because these are RGB LEDs. So that means that I can switch the color, red, blue, green. It's got a bunch of different colors you can cycle through and there's different modes. So there's like a, I guess that's all the colors flashing really fast. We've got all the individual colors flashing. Oh, it's just got a bunch of different modes and then you can speed it up or slow it down if you want. So there's a lot of options with a built-in controller. So I thought this was pretty slick because a lot of times you'll buy an LED strip and it'll come with like this block that's a controller that you have to plug it into and you have to power that with another cable and plug that into the wall. This is something that you can just like carry the entire thing around throw it on a, a gate and have your, your gates lit up with a little battery pack, whether you're inside, outside, whether you have power to plug into a wall or not, and it's all very nice and compact. So I actually got two of these. So we've got our two LED strips that are powered by our remote batteries that are pretty dang bright. So that's all I got for mail time. If you want to see more of what I do with these, check on Facebook and Twitter, and I will see you next time.